What's up, you two? Retro Bro, the D O Double G is back again. What are you looking at? What are you looking at? With a little friend to help me along with this video. Here. I have no idea how this is going to go, but let's give it a go anyway. I'm back talking about some of my favourite movies of all time, and we can't go past this one. An absolute classic. Yippee ki yay, mother. What are you looking at? Can I swear around you? <laughs> okay, you bad. Uh, die hard. Bruce Willis. Let's get into it. One and all, and wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. It's Christmas Eve in LA. But a team of terrorists. You want money? What kind of terrorists are you? Who said we were terrorists? Have their own holiday plans. And I'm telling you, you're just going to have to kill me. Okay. We do it the hard way. But the one thing they didn't plan on was New York cop John McLean. Got invited to the Christmas party by mistake. Who knew? What a fantastic action movie this is. Absolute classic. I can't tell you how many times I've actually watched this. And I'm sure many of you guys have watched this as well that many times. But um, look, there's always that really good debate over whether it's a Christmas movie or not. It has to be the best Christmas movie of all time, surely. Um, you know, it happens basically at Christmas time. You know, the night before or something like that. So, you know, Bruce Willis, John McClane takes on a whole bunch of terrorists, wipes them out in awesome style, one by one, all the way down to the final boss in Hans Gruber, hanging off the edge of the uh, building, through the window. You know, what a classic and awesome scene that is. That's not a hostage. Love the fight between the, uh, the the blonde dude, the German blonde dude that he has, uh, where he hangs him up in the chain at the end of it, and he's hanging, and then oh, and then right at the end, obviously he comes back and goes to shoot him at the end when he's hugging his missus at the end, and then good old pal, pal, uh, saves the day. Of course, classic scenes where Hans is like, shoot the glass, and they mow down all the glass, and then he's just got bare feet and he's got to run through the glass. And... What? Yeah, you know what I'm talking about, right? In the glass scene? Yeah. Shoot the glass. little one-liners like of course the yippee ki yay mother uh, I won't swear in front of little bubba I think you have a chance against us Mr. Cowboy yippee ki yay motherfucker when, when, he, when he throws the body out the window and it lands on the cop car and he's like welcome to the party pal welcome to the party pal the part where he goes in from the, uh, the air vent swings down off the elevator into the vent, lights up a little lighter. Ah, oh, come down to the coast, have a few laughs. Come down to the coast, we'll get together, have a few laughs. Even as a kid, man, watching this growing up, uh, I was allowed to watch it as a kid. It's rated M15, a lot of swear words and stuff, but one of the all-time great terrorists, hero-saving 
kind of movie. Die Hard, baby. Absolutely love this movie. One of my all-time favourites. And I'm sure many of others. I don't know anyone out there who said Die Hard is terrible, but what do you reckon, Abby? Is it good? Yeah, it's good. <laughs> He's an easy guy to like. Welcome to the party, pal. And a hard man to kill. Bruce Willis. Die Hard. Look, hey, that went pretty smooth. She's pretty, uh, she's pretty chilled on that little uh, rusk that she's just chilling on. But hey, this is the new, this is the new world now. Retro Bros, we got with dads sticking around on YouTube with special guests. Anyway, peace. Get into it if you haven't. I'm out of here. Peace.